It's been a while since I've seen a, a video of the Wikipedia functionality of viewing an article's history and comparing selected revisions, and the functionality has significantly improved in the past few years, so I wanted to record a demo from my students. Here we're looking at a Wikipedia article for the Dorodango, which is that Japanese practice of shaping and polishing mud balls, something I find very appealing. And we can click on the view history, and we see a log of all the little different edits that people have made over time. We can often just like say, I want to see the previous version. And you know, there's various things that we can look at, but let's dig into those options. If we go back in time, we can see that user V2Blast made a sequence of edits, four edits. And I would like to see what they contributed across all four edits since the Internet Archive bot came along and included some archive URLs in some of the citations. So I'm going to click this version, and then I'm going to click the last version made by V2Blast. And then if I come up here and I click Compare Selected Versions, I can see this not terribly comprehensible version showing, for instance, that the word mud was lowercased over here. If I want to look at the wiki text but have a more comprehensible way of seeing the changes, I can click the inline, and then the tealish color, like blue, is things that were added, and the mustard color are things that were deleted. So here again, I can see that shift from mud to lowercase. I can also look at a visual mode. So here they're using slightly different colors and strike throughs to show me what things have been changed. Something else you can do is you can browse the history interactively. So if I like the wiki text version inline the best, I can see this particular change. And then I can go to the previous edit and see that particular change and go through the previous edit and see that change. And I can also drag these to see all the differences between these two particular versions. So I hope that was useful and that it helps you understand what's going on with a Wikipedia article's history.